The best robot vacuums on a budget for 2024. Don't spend a fortune on an autonomous dirt sucker. When we consider which budget robot vacuums to test in this video, we look at each machine's specs and feature list, as well as online reviews to get a general idea of its capabilities. With each robot vacuum we review, we set it up as per the instructions and use it for as long as possible, at minimum, we'll use each for one week, running cleaning cycles daily. We make sure to try out any physical buttons the machine has on it, and any app power features like scheduling, smart mapping, and more. Since we test robot vacuums in our own homes, there are obstacles already in the machine's way like tables, chairs, and other furniture, this helps us understand how capable the machine is at avoiding obstacles, and will intentionally throw smaller items in their way like shoes, pet toys, and more. With robot vacuums that include clean bases, we assess how loud the machine is while emptying contents into the base and roughly how long it takes for us to fill up the bag or bagless base with debris. Number 1. Best Budget Robot Vacuum Overall, iRobot Roomba 694 Robot Vacuum. Good for pet hair, carpets, hard floors. While it lacks the advanced navigational skills of higher-end models, the Roomba 694 can clean more than 1,000 square feet of floor space on a single charge, then find its way back to the included charging station when it finishes or needs to juice back up. With a button on the robot, you can activate a spot clean feature in which the Roomba 694 will repeatedly circle its immediate vicinity to ensure that it's extra clean. You can control the vacuum with the iRobot Home app or your voice, or you can schedule cleaning runs. Who it's for? From battery life to cleaning performance, the Roomba 694 checks all the boxes for an affordable robot vacuum. Since it still uses bump navigation, this model is perfect for those who don't care how long the vacuum takes to work. Like most models in this price range, it doesn't support self-emptying, but you'll save hundreds of dollars with this model over a more advanced Roomba. We recommend setting cleaning schedules to really get the most out of the device. After all, these are semi-autonomous robots, so why not make it so you rarely have to interact with them? Doing so will ensure the Roomba runs through your home on a regular basis, so you're always left with clean floors. The Roomba 694 in particular did a good job sucking up dirt and debris on my carpets as well as the tile flooring in my kitchen and bathrooms. The only thing I try to do before a cleaning job is get charging cables off of the floor. The Roomba will stop if it sucks something like that up, and it's relatively easy to extract a cable from the machine's brushes, but I'd rather not have to do so if I could avoid it. When it comes to battery life, the Roomba 694 ran for around 45 minutes, before needing to dock and recharge. iRobot says run times will vary based on floor surfaces, but the 694 is estimated to have a 90-minute battery life, when cleaning hardwood floors. While 45 minutes may be enough time for the robot to scuttle around most rooms in my apartment, those with larger homes may have to wait for it to recharge in order to clean everywhere. Number 2. Eufy Clean L60 Robot Vacuum, for deep floor cleaning, ideal for hair, hard floors. When it comes to keeping our homes clean and tidy, we know how important it is to have the right tools. That's why we highly recommend considering the Eufy Clean L60 Robotic Vacuum. This innovative device offers a range of features and benefits that make it an ideal choice for households of all sizes. One of the standout features of the Eufy Clean L60 is its ultra-strong 5,000 Pascal suction power. With this incredible suction power, the vacuum effortlessly removes hair, crumbs, and dust in just one pass, leaving your floors cleaner than ever before. Scientific research has shown that higher suction power leads to more efficient and effective cleaning, and the Eufy Clean L60 certainly delivers on that front. Another noteworthy feature of the Eufy Clean L60 is its precision mapping capabilities. Using advanced iPath laser navigation technology, this robotic vacuum scans each room and creates accurate maps to optimize its cleaning routes. This ensures that every corner of your home is thoroughly cleaned, saving you time and effort. The accuracy of this navigation has been endorsed by experts in the field, making it a reliable choice for efficient cleaning. Furthermore, the L60 includes hair detangling technology, where a small blade cuts through hair that collects on the brush roll, thereby releasing it into the dustbin. This reduces the need for manual hair removal from the roller brush, and allows for an even greater hand-free cleaning experience. Number 3. Roborock S7 Robot Vacuum and Mop Combo The Roborock S7 is decent for bare floors. It clears small and bulky debris with little difficulty but struggles, 
with lifting away debris and cracks and crevices. It's also amazingly well built, maneuvers itself efficiently, and, depending on your usage patterns and choice of settings, lasts long enough on a single charge to clean large areas without difficulty. Its ultrasonic mopping module is impressively effective in dealing with dried on dirt and debris. It surpassed others in our performance tests and was loved by the consumers who tested it in their own homes. I saw firsthand how this little champ moved easily from bare floors to carpets, made its way under low furniture, including my king-size bed, and fully covered my test areas picking up all the dry oatmeal, rice, and synthetic pet hair I put down. The S7 has a floating rubber brush instead of one, with bristles which helps minimize pet hair tangles, and it handled uneven surfaces better than other models in our test. When it came to wet mopping, it covered my entire kitchen floor, putting down enough water to clean it without leaving it too wet, and it scrubbed away any stuck-on mess as I put in its path. The Roborock S7 Robot Vacuum is a great value. It's an outstanding performer with a wide array of high-end features that mimic those of robots twice its price. If you are looking for a gift to upgrade from an entry-level model or just want an effective, easy-to-use, mid-priced pick with lots of tech capabilities, this S7 is a great choice. Number 4. WYZE Robot Vacuum with LiDAR Mapping Technology The WISE Robot Vacuum is a good performer on bare floors. It's very well built and delivers incredible performance on surfaces like hardwood and laminate, where it easily clears pet hair and debris. Unfortunately, it has a small dirt compartment and like many robot models, incurs high recurring costs. That said, it does a good job of maneuvering itself and moves in an organized pattern. The biggest drawback to this vacuum is the lack of self-emptying base. Now, I personally have no issue with emptying the dustbin after a cleaning cycle, since I have to do this with an upright or handheld vacuum anyway, but in the spirit of autonomous cleaning machines, it's definitely a major perk to have a vacuum that empties itself. For me, in my 750-square-foot apartment, I didn't need to empty the vacuum mid-cleaning, but if you have a large home with lots of pet hair or debris, you might need to empty it before the vacuum is finished cleaning your entire space. The dustbin for the Wise Robot Vacuum, open and full of dust, hair, and lint. Number 5. Shark IQ Robot Vacuum. The Shark IQ Robot Self-Empty XL Vacuum holds up to a month's worth of dust and debris in its base station and features a self-cleaning brush roll and lots of smart features for a truly low-maintenance experience. In testing, the Robot XL always successfully maneuvered around furniture and traversed area rugs, carpeting, and hard flooring with ease. On its first two runs, it never once got stuck, even on places that have tripped up other robot vacuums in the past, such as the cords under my bedroom dresser. After each test run, my floors looked noticeably cleaner. I have a pit bull named Bradley who sheds, and the IQ Robot XL did an excellent job of collecting his fur from my floors. A high concentration of dog hair usually collects on the floor around my living room couch, where Brad likes to relax during the day. When I checked this area after the IQ Robot XL cleaned, it was completely free of dog hair. It also left behind no trace of hair from the white rug in my office. After those first two test runs, I could already see some debris through the docking station's fill window. Though it wasn't nearly all the way filled, I emptied it early for testing purposes, and was pleasantly surprised to see how much dirt, debris, and dog hair the robot collected. Next, I checked the brush roll on the bottom to verify Shark's claim that it can clean itself. I'll admit, I was a bit skeptical, but it actually works. After two cleaning sessions, the brush roll on the bottom of the robot was hair-free. As someone with long hair, one of my biggest problems with robot vacuums is that after a few runs, hair gets wrapped around the main brush. I then have to remove the brush and cut away the hair, a seriously icky task. You still might have to do this at some point with the IQ Robot XL, but less frequently than other robot vacuums, a big perk if you have long hair or live with someone who does.